Elaria Baldwin made a suggestion that she could be willing to move west and away from the East Coast. Within a day of declaring on the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills that Alec Baldwin's wife would be her dream cast mate, 40-year-old Kyle Richards uploaded a cute photo of herself with her daughter Maria Lucia in the City of Angels. She said, We love Beverly Hills, as the caption for a photo of herself and her three-year-old daughter taken on a rooftop. In the photo, Ilaria, wearing an off-the-shoulder white shirt, a torn denim miniskirt, and nude high heels, grinned at her young daughter as they shared a sweet treat. In a white dress and pink sandals, Maria looked adorable. Richard said that Ilaria would be a fantastic addition to the show on this Wednesday's Let's Talk Off Camera with Kelly Ripa segment on Sirius XM. The mother of four added that her choice lives in New York, but maybe she would move in response to a direct question on who she would want to join the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills series next season. Richards added that she had already discussed the proposal with Alec, who is presently being prosecuted for manslaughter. I informed him. I mentioned something about it a few years ago, but I'm not sure. Oh, we're living in New York, he says, but I'm not sure why. When he mentioned her in Los Angeles, I thought, well, the door is open. Then, Ripa and co-host Jan Schille brought up the news that Baldwin had previously revealed that he and Ilaria were thinking about producing a reality TV series. They're trying to find a reality program. He informed us. He informed us, said Schille. But wait, that's right, Ripa said. Give it a minute. Hold on. During this podcast, Alec Baldwin stated that they are searching for a reality show. Following Richard's admission that she had discussed the concept with Baldwin, Ripa jokes. Jan is phoning Andy Cohen as we speak. That would make for some incredible TV. Alec said in November of last year that he is wanting to give up acting and spend more time at home. So he and his wife Ilaria have been pitching a reality TV program centered upon their family life. The boss baby actor, who shot and killed Helena Hutchins on the Russ movie set, may face involuntary manslaughter charges. He is the father of eight children. He has a daughter Ireland, 28, from his marriage to Kim Basinger, 69, and he shares seven with Ilaria. In an interview with Ripa, Alec disclosed that he aspires to allow cameras into his New York residence, emulating the Kardashians and the Osbournes. It comes after he said that his earnings from a prior project had hardly made a profit since he was spending them on lodging, airfare, and food for his massive family. Back in the day, I used to hop on a plane, fly to Los Angeles, and work on a movie here or a few episodes of Will and Grace for a while, he remarked. You know, various things along those lines. It was also simple to pick up and go. They don't even have the 12 plane tickets I need for my wife kids, and nannies, among other things. There aren't even 11 seats available in the plane's business class. He went on. We'd be in a hotel and we always stayed in the same hotel because it was the only hotel that could put four suites together, so we could all live together. He was recalling a work trip to Los Angeles around four years ago. You. Realize we're not gonna make a dime, we're not gonna make one cent. I said to my wife. Here we have $20 room service, mashed potatoes, and a diet. A can of Coke costs $11. You realize we're not going to make a penny. I remarked. The hotel, the room service, the private jet, we're going to break even on this work I'm doing. So everything we did and then, shows we have considered and pitches we've heard, and even one or two pitches we've made about our family and that reality show has been so we could stay home and just work from home. Alec continued, revealing the type of work he and Ilaria are currently looking for. I'd give anything to try working from New York. Kelly remarked, I think it's the smartest thing, in response to his shocking revelation about his reality TV show. I would definitely watch the show because you seem to be deeply involved in the Hollywood industry. It is well known that you are an actress. Alec and Ilaria live in New York City with their children, Carmen, 10. Raphael, 8, Leonardo, 6, Romeo, 5, Eduardo and Maria Lucia Lucia, 3, and Ilaria, 1 year old. He reaffirmed in the same interview that he was thinking about giving up acting. 
Alex said to Kelly. I've been working less and less and more at home with my wife and we want to travel the world with the kids. I want to show seven kids places like Rome, London, Paris, Madrid, and so on and so forth. And we're considering that right now, as our job lives have changed. I actually do think about, you know, I've kind of had enough. I mean, I've done this for a long time, and I want to have a private life, he continued. Kyle, Erica Girardi, Dorit Kemsley, Garcel Beauvais, Sutton Strake, Crystal Kung Minkoff, and Anne-Marie Wiley are the members of the cast of the most recent season, 13. There is a vacancy as Wiley was let go from the show after less than a season due to the other cast members, disgusted, reactions to her views on transgender athletes, devotion to Team Mega, and ardent support of Donald Trump. Elaria would bring a lot of intrigue to the program, no doubt. She spent years saying Majorca was her birthplace and that she had come to the U.S. at the age of 19, but in 2021 she confessed for fabricating her Spanish origin and was made to admit she was born in Boston and went by the name Hillary. Her parents were American, and she was raised in Weston, Massachusetts, without even the faintest trace of a foreign accent, according to several of her former classmates. The woman who originally revealed the hoax subsequently told the New York Times that Ilaria's fabricated ethnicity was an open secret in Manhattan and that she and her pals eventually decided to be clean because they were bored with the pandemic. Several tapes of Ilaria's previous TV appearances reappeared in the following days, demonstrating her dedication to a Spanish accent. In a now-famous video clip from the Today Show, Ilaria seemed to be confused about the English name for cucumber. Ilaria expressed regret and claimed she should have been more open about her ties to Spanish culture once her American origin was made public.